All right, so welcome back to another episode where we crank out some more profit and loss questions. Michael received a discount of 15% on a TV he purchased. He then sold it at a profit of 10% for $2,200. What was the original price? So we're going to have to work backwards by finding the price after the 10% discount was applied. I mean, the 10% profit was applied. I'm sorry. Yeah, so we know that the final result was 2200 And this was because a 10% profit was applied. To some number we don't know. So a 10% profit was applied to some number we don't know, which resulted in 2200 Let's find that number. We rewrite this as such. 2200 equal P times 1.1. Divide both sides by 1.1. What do we get? 2200, 2200, 1.1. 2000. So we cancel this and we cancel... We break down this, and P is equal to 2,000. All right? So P is equal to 2,000. So this was a value before the profit of 10% was applied. All right? We need, to take, we need to take it one step back and find the value before the 15% was applied. All right? So this is the value after this 15% was applied all right so this is the value after this 15 percent discount was applied so if this is the value after it was applied we know that 2000 must be equal to some value we call it let's call it t this time t after a discount of 0 0.15 was applied all right, so we know that 2,000 was equal to T multiplied by 0 0.85. Because this minus 0 0.15 is equal, to, is equal to 0 0.85. Divide both sides by the 0 0.85. All right. Cool. So we now divide 2,000 by 0 0.85 and we get which implies that t is equal to 2 3 5 2 point nine four. sorry this is kind of untidy however I'm sure you get the picture so now this is the original price 15% discount was applied to this, which brought it to 2000 All right? And then a 10% profit was applied to the 2000 to bring it to 2200 All right? So this is how we do it. We work it backwards. The 2200 was the last figure. So we have to find out what value brought us to the 2200 that value was 2000 then we have to find out what value brought us with, with the discount to 2000 and we proceed as such subtract this come over here 0 0.85 multiplied by t is equal to 2000 we want t by itself we divide both sides by 0 0.85 0 0.85 the result is this all right, it's a bit tedious, but just think about it a little bit more and I'm sure you'll, I'm sure you'll get it. Moving on to the next example. A book costing $1,100 was sold at a markup of 15%. That's a profit of 15%. Then bought back at a discount of 15%. What is the final price? So we know that 100 was marked up by 1 plus 0 0.15.
this is equal to 100 multiplied by 1 point which is equal to $115 all right so I sold my book for a hundred and fifteen dollars and then I bought it back I bought it back however I received a discount of 15 percent so I bought back the book but I received a discount of 15 percent you see I received a discount of 15 percent which is which is represented as such so it's going to be 115 multiplied by 0 0.85, do the multiplication, which is equal to 97.75. I know it looks weird. You sold it at a profit of 15 and you bought it back at a discount of 15. Shouldn't it be the 100? Nope, it will not be the 100. If I increase $100 by 10% and then decrease that by 10%, it's not going to be the same. I can show that to you, but I'll do it at a later date. So here we have, we increase it by 15% and got this, then decrease it by 15% and got this, which is less than our $100. All right, so this is our final, final, final price the final price we bought it for all right great next question a checkout terminal at a checkout terminal a general consumption tax gct was applied to a video game console costing one thousand five hundred and fifty dollars what is the total price so gct in jamaica it varies across countries, but GCT in Jamaica is 15%. So when we apply the 15% to the game console, what do we get? We get 1550 multiplied by 1 plus the 15% equal 1550 times 1.15, which is equal to... Seventeen eight two five. All right, so this is the price after the tax was applied. All right, this is a simple question. We apply the GCT tax to the total or to the cost of the game. The total is now this. So this is what you'll pay at the checkout, even though the price tag says this. All right, pretty straightforward. All right, so a bicycle is purchased at 2,800 plus GCT, 15%. How much was paid for the bicycle? Same procedure, 2,800, 2,800 multiplied by 1.15, which is equal to 2,800 times 1.15, 3, two two zero all right and that's your gct that's j2t stay tuned for more examples